Hello everybody, this is Ron with GPS Fishing Maps, a Waypoint Development Company. I'm here today uh, on a Windows PC to show you what these files that we send to you when you purchase them, what they, what they look like and what comes with them. Any purchase that you would make from us comes with these fishing spots files in a zip file and you'll want to save these to your desktop there's a video on how to do that from your email because they're emailed directly to you keep in mind there's no download link for our files anymore they're directly emailed to you and digitally registered in your name only um, but once once it's unzipped this is what you have I've have extract click extract and save these to my desktop and they're ready to use it makes a folder for them and puts them right here for you um, if you tell the zip program to do so let's get into it then so I'm gonna choose let's just go with the Florida Keys just because I like that mm, who doesn't like the keys right so instructions these are also included outside the zip file in the email we send in case you're on a mobile device you don't want to have to mess around with that zip file because it's a pain on a mobile device and we are aware of that so you get outside the zip instructions all the Google files so you can open up a Google Earth on iOS or Android Droid and you get the coordinates list outside the zip file you've got tutorials here and GPS SD card files here for loading to your GPS which we go over in other videos on how to do that stuff it's very easy copy and paste stuff all right so take a quick view of the instructions these the instructions is a text file it'll open just about with anything on a mobile device or any computer Mac or PC okay so read those thoroughly from top to bottom if you would and then make sure Google Earth is installed on your device or your computers uh, Mac or PC again and uh, the file you want to use if you can if you're if you have the memory and the connection um, a good connection to the internet uh, to data um, 4G is best on mobile obviously the Google chart let's double click it and get into it and again this is the Florida Keys and this is the, actually what you'll see this is the actual file that you would you would you would receive if you had ordered the Florida Keys this is like the file what's really neat is after this loads what comes up in the background and it's loading and BAM just like that it's just this is actually a Google Earth view I don't got any there's nothing tricky going on uh, this file uh, the maps come built in to the Google Earth file when you receive it it'll look just like you're seeing it here on your computer or mobile device it's much easier on a computer to look at this stuff though because of the speed of a computer obviously and it's great for trip planning because the screens bigger that's that's the biggest reason all right I'm going to zoom in here and show you what it looks like and let the map clear up. Again, that good connection matters here because these maps are big. And um, this is kind of what it looks like. In more detail, uh, especially around channels, it shows markers and etc. Um, but if you wanted to see what was what was out of spot, let's just pick a, let's just pick a random spot. Okay, you would tap on it on a mobile device, on a computer. We would click on it once, and uh, We've not had this in a low res video so we can actually load it to YouTube in a decent amount of time. So if you can't read this, it says Patch Reef Yellowtail Snapper Grouper Mackerel on flat lines. So um, that's obviously a patch reef spot, which are yellowtail is uh, or all aka flags are the bigger yellowtails in the keys. One of the biggest attractions that are there in the best eating fish arguably in America. Okay, and the patch reef spots are mostly going to all say the same thing. You might find slight, uh, slight detail differences in them, though. Like this one says, snapper and mangrove, day or night, chum heavy, which you always should do when you're patch reef fishing. If you stop the chum, the fish go away. You keep the chum going, you get horse ballyhoo in there, you get uh, several types of bait, thread fins, cigar minnows, you get uh, several different kinds of snapper going. You just get the, you make your own ecosystem right behind the boat when you chum like that um, we won't get into fishing right now I'm just showing you the product you uh, know let's zoom back out again and just take a look I'll tell you what let's uh, let's find a channel here let's see if we can find one going in maybe G fish Creek or something like that let's find us a channel 
and we'll look at some channel markers here. This may be something we can, yeah, let's check this out. Let the map load. And this may not be a, a big enough channel to have markers on it. This could be a privately marked channel. Nope, this one's good. We've got, as you can see, it shows the channel markers. And if you were here, it would it would show you on your Google Earth app or whatever app you end up using to load these Google files. It would show you uh, some of you know special icons. You could you could show a, a boat, uh, a blue dot, green dot, whatever you'd want to be. If you were riding out this channel, it would show you in this channel. So the maps are very uh, very accurate. We always you know can't tell you to use them for your main navigation. Obviously, uh, always use a GPS for that. But as secondary navigation and trip planning, these maps are simply amazing. Very up to date. You're not going to find anything else more up to date than these background maps. They're within a month of being, they're, they're updated every month is, is the bottom line with them. And uh, We'll just zoom into another channel area here. Let's see if this one's big enough to be marked. Check it out. Mm, yep, it's, well, not really, but it's got you can see some markers out here off of it and uh, as you look at these charts you'll see stuff um, like GRS that means grass there's a snag here that could be a pipe or um, part of an old wreck or a mast anything like that here you have some rocky bottom RKY um, that's gonna be good fishing right there from that five to ten feet right through there obviously a drop-off be some good uh, good patch reef bottom fish in there um, but that's a quick overlay that's again this is just the Florida Keys you get this same exact file with any area you order um, this file comes with it in this format but it will be the spots that you've purchased obviously and anyhow that's a quick rundown on the the Google Earth uh, map file that works with PC Mac or iOS droid and Android phones and tablets and we'll do another video shortly on GPS SD card files. Thanks for watching and good fishing to you.